Hello YouTube! Welcome to the unboxing of Arthur, one of the Super Mecha Champion model kits. Those were available through Amiami. Um, there were three released, Arthur, Caramel and Hurricane. I got all three. You also got a transparent version, but that didn't interest me. They're uh, not by Bandai, they're by another brand. Uh, Snaplock, uh, ready painted uh, the old rule. Though I'm gonna glue parts and paint parts like always with uh, model kits, because that's part of the fun as well. Um, Arthur is one of the two uh, starter mechs in the game, he's like basically a knight with a big sword, so needle serving for the other one. If you see my YouTube channel, uh, I usually tend to take the gunner mechs like the Firefox or Trio Vendors or the newly released Skyfall. But yeah, let's unbox this little kit. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be too much of a pain to paint though. You can see the transparent boxes of the runners, there are three of them. So, uh, backpack, that's open. <laughs> Comes with a nice backdrop printed on uh, the box on the inside. And then we have the instructions inside the backdrop, together with a sticker sheet, which I won't be using. So, the stickers always come up anyway, uh, whether it's stickers or stickers, uh, even with Gunpla after the years or sometimes uh, even with HG, HG grades uh, pretty soon they come loose and then uh, I just prefer to uh, paint on the details. And since I'm not a great painter, who cares that they're not uh, nice and straight in? But uh, here we are, three runners. Got the transparent parts, I can't paint it because it's transparent. The renders deconnect like this, so it makes it easy to store them inside a smaller package. So, pre painted plastic, as you can see, details like here the gold for his helmet or the crayon is just they're all included. Solid plastic, maybe if it's too brittle, it don't look like it. So, go judging by the source, yeah. That's good plastic for a model kit. Second runner is all the limbs and stuff, so we can put that back together. Voila. And then the third one is with the transparent parts and the gold parts on it, so that's gonna be some careful painting to get the gold done. And uh, what looks like the joints for the inner frame, well, not really inner frame, but uh, for the legs and the arms and everything, so. Nice little kit, it seems. I'm also gonna build uh, stats for them in Super Mecha Champions uh, to use it in the games of Mecha Top on the table. Though I don't think uh, there will be uh, any match for a game on one on one because they're smaller for starters. And the Mecha Top, well, let's put this correctly on. One of the things that defines the power of the mech is how big it is. So I'm gonna be around 20 meters in these around. Uh, I guess five, six meters if you want to look at the game. They're gonna be low type grunts, but yeah, strength in numbers. But that's for later on. So that's the kit. I'm gonna enjoy assembling this and give it a try. Mini kits, always fun. And thanks for watching. When is done, I'll come back to it with a painted version and a base version. And uh, if you want to follow its progress, uh, go to my blog, uh, whenever I work on something, uh, it just blows on my weekly Saturday updates. If I don't do anything, there's another Saturday update, of course. For the rest, like, subscribe, thank you for watching, and see you next time. Bye-bye.